Today I'm going to show you step-by-step uh, -step instructions on how to set up a Cisco Linksys. Get that in focus, E1200 router. So the first thing you do is you connect the power cable and then you connect your computer to one of these uh, LAN cables, which I did. Any one of these four, one, two, three, four and then connect this to your computer and turn the computer on basically and I'll go to the next step okay now I'm on my computer and uh, you just open up any web browser just gonna open up Firefox you could use um, Chrome or anything else as well Internet Explorer or uh, Edge whatever you want but I'm using um, Mozilla Firefox so just type in the IP address that the default IP address to connect to the router is it's 192.168.1.1 press enter and you get to this screen um, what I want to do is I want to go into the settings not use the software setup so you just go to continue with an open and unsecure network. It's going to ask you this. I understand that my network is currently open and not secure. I would like to manually configure my router's security settings. Yes, continue. Uh, the default password is, um, I think it's admin for user and admin for password. Type that in. Okay, so now you get here. You could go here, click on do not show this to me again. And you could change the host name. I think this is your network ID. Call it MyNet. Call the domain name. This, I think this is a login name. My name in there. The IP address. DHCP server should be enabled. If you're going to use this as your primary. Go to wireless security. Should be WPA2, WPA, mix mode. Just put my, put your password in here. Just put my password. Write that down somewhere so you don't forget it. Gotta write that down. Okay. Save settings. Gonna name my network name, router name. <coughs> Call it Mnet. Get a pen that works first. Let me write this down. I want to go to wireless and check. You could set up a guest network if you want. It's up to you. But I don't want a guest network. But you could set it up. You could allow 
guest access. The password is just guess. If you if you want. Okay, so the only things you want to change here is you want to change the host name. I think that's the network Wi-Fi network ID. This is what I name mine. Domain name is your login name. You want to go to administration and change your password. Save that. Now it's going to ask you for your, your name. Okay, now it works. So now I change the password. and the login name. Okay, now I'm back to my router again. So what I do is I just connect this part, this yellow part which says internet on it. I'm gonna get that in focus. And I'm gonna connect that to my broadband modem. For me, it's a cable modem, so I'm just gonna connect I connected this directly to my uh, cable modem and I can connect one of these blue ports which is a LAN uh, port to a computer or I could connect it to a uh, network switch and connect it to other computers but for me I'm just connecting to this router via Wi-Fi so none of the LAN ports are populated as a result so that's what you could do if you want to connect your computer so that's all you so the blue ports are the LAN ports local area network and the yellow part is called internet that's called the WAN port or wide area network and you connect that to your broadband modem and uh, that's pretty much it okay thanks for watching